Hey guys, it's Heather Miracle, your Scentsy Consultant. Uh, I got a package the other day and I've been waiting on getting this guy. So I wanted to share with you, it's fresh in the box, but this is the Scentsy Air Purifier. I have posted about this, not so much recently. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and unbox this with you and show you what it looks like. Sorry, it's fresh out the box, so there's like twisty ties and stuff. Um, I do know this uses Scentsy Pods, and I pulled out a pack of pods to show you where they go. This is obviously just the plug. Um, it uses a HEPA H13 filter that removes 99.5. 95% of air particles. Um, so I was going to use this in my massage room. Um, I do have an air purifier in there, um, but it's older and I couldn't find um, replacement filters for it. Um, since he does have replacement filters for these. Um, ooh, I'm so excited. Um, I'm gonna be taking this in with me tomorrow. I'm trying to see if there's any other specs. I know that I've posted some of these. I did say it uses up to two Scentsy Pods. Um, there's three fan settings, auto mode, low and high. Um, it can run continuously or you can set a timer for two, four or eight hours. Um, there is an air quality indicator light that lets you know when the, when air, or when particles are detected and when the air is clean. And it says that it is ideal for small spaces up to 200 square feet, like nurseries, bedrooms, and more, which is why I thought this would be nice for my massage room, because it is small. But look at this guy. Let me get it plugged in for you. There's a little instruction pamphlet that comes along with it, too. I was just reading out of the catalog all the specs for you. I know I've sent some things out um, in August to people. So, and it had all those specs. Um, the replacement filters, like I said, they do sell them, but they are $35. Um, and I think that's really about it. Um, it says this is 11 inches tall. So that's what it looks like. So this is the top. That's where your pods will go. Um, I don't have it plugged in yet, but I will get it plugged in. So, oh, it just fell out of there. Something fell out of there. So they just sit in like that. Um, I'm not gonna put pods in it right now though. I used my pods in my car. Um, but there is the option for that. Um, there is a red label. It says remove filter packaging before use. So it's just showing you that the filter is down here, I believe. Yeah, there's a lock icon and an unlock. So you just twist it to the left to unlock it. But I probably have to take off that. Um, And turn it upside down and I said left to unlock it and the filter that's actually bigger than I expected um, is wrapped in plastic so you'll just have to remove the plastic like it said on the label so there is your filter and like I had previously said they sell these replacement um, ones for $35. Um, how I got this was a, I got it half off because I had 
a link open. Did I put that in wrong? I think I did. You have to make sure this is on the bottom because there's, this is like indented. That's the little grip to be able to twist it. So I had it the other way. And there, um, and there's an arrow for the unlock and locked icon. So that arrow, I think needs to, yeah, point at the unlock and then you snap over to lock it. And you can see the buttons on there. There is the two, the four, the eight. So I'm assuming that's the power button and then that's how you set the timer. Um, fan mode. And then I'm not sure what that little light button is. Oh, here's the instructions. I was looking in the catalog. That is the air quality indicator button. So do I have it turned? Um, this will light up when you need to replace your filter. Let me see what else I'm missing. I'm not seeing air quality indicator light on or off. So I guess you could turn that on or off, but I'm trying to see. It'll give you a white light if the um Air quality is good and a red light if it is poor. Um, but you can really read through this when you get one. But how I got this, back to that, because I sidetracked. Um, and I'll plug this in and turn it on to show you how loud it is. Because I have seen a video myself. Oh, that's where the power button or button plug part is but I got this I had a link open and when you have a party link or a shopping link you there we go once you um sorry I keep sidetracking um once you get five hundred dollars in orders you can use the three half offs that you would earn by getting your party link or your shopping link to that amount. Um, you get three half offs. So that would make this, this would take all three of the half offs, but you would get this half off. So that's what I did to get it um, a little um, discounted. Um, it is 250 straight if you want to buy it that way. Um, and then you um, have the product credit that you can use towards a filter and pods. Um, I believe when it hits um, 500, it's $75 um, that you get in product credit. And I will double check that just so I'm not telling you the wrong thing, but I'm pretty sure. Yes. So if you're at exactly 500, you'd get three half offs, which you could get this half off. And then you'd have $75 so you could get... Um, pods. I mean, they come in bundle and saves. Um, and then, sorry, stink bugs are everywhere and that scared me. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can use the product credit for the additional things. I was going to get an, an additional filter, um, but I figured I would just wait um, because it comes with one. So I will plug this guy in. If I have a plug, I'm going to have to unplug my computer charging cord thing. So hold on one second. Hopefully this, yeah. Okay. So hopefully this doesn't turn off anything. So it's plugged in and my hoodie string is tied around the cord. So give me a second. Uh, how did it get so tangled? Okay. That's just because they're long. Um, so I will turn this guy on and let you listen. So the power button, and it does show you what all the buttons mean here. I just kind of guessed, and I got most of them right when I was showing them a second ago. 
Um, but power button on. And it's white, so that means the air quality is good. That's good because this is in my house. Um, but if you listen, it's not that loud. And I honestly feel like, what fan mode is this one? That is a little louder. So you hit, um, when it's turned on, it'll be in default mode. Press once to enter high feet, or high speed. I can't talk today. Um, second time for low. And a third time to enter default mode again. But what I like about these, I'll get it, put it back on high just so you can hear the loudest it would get. Hopefully you can hear this. Here. So, like I said, I have a different air purifier. It was an old one my mom had given me that she had gotten. Um, I think it was really aimed and targeted for hairstylists um, to help with like the stinky smells in the salon, um, the chemical smells and stuff. Um, sorry. Anyway. <laughs> um, and so I was using that one, but like I said, I didn't, couldn't find replacement filters for that. And when, since he came out with this, with the new catalog, I was like, I have to have that for the massage room. So I'm glad that it does get louder because the one that I have in the massage room, um, it has different settings and stuff as well. Um, but I like that it can kind of double as a, um, white noise machine almost. Um, I've used one before in a massage room. And I like having that to kind of drown out the background noise. So I think this doubles as one. Plus, um, I love my pods and I get them for my car. So I already get these and this is just great to have so that I do have a warmer and a diffuser in there. So I kind of alternate what I'm using in the massage room just depending on the day. So I don't have to use these with it, but it does have the capability of me just putting some pods in there to fill up the room. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited to get this set up tomorrow at work. Um, and just like with all the other products, this does have a warranty. So if anything goes wrong, um, trying to see if it says anything about that on here. Cause I know people that have had warmers, all they have to do is, um, show that they have a kind of like receipt or an order number for the product. Um, I think one time I didn't have that and they still mailed it out that you just have to return the defective product back. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's really all I think I have about this. Let me check the catalog, make sure there's nothing else I forgot to read off of here to you. Um, all this information is on my site as well. Um, but I'm excited to get using it. I'll let you all know how it works. And I will talk to you guys soon. If you have any questions, please reach out. Bye.